what we consider learning and what we have to sh- prove to parents is learning sometimes become two different things now in this in this crazy times a lot of parents are also questioning what schools are and what what because their mindset is that learning can only take place when the teacher is in front of the classroom delivering a lecture and that has to change for us to really uh, talk about true learning because there there are consequences of while we just pander to the idea of okay, the teacher has to be present to take a class so now now what's happening is because we that's the method that we all accept the teacher has to lead the class when has this pandemic has started is that what everybody was doing first in school they have just now moved the whole thing on zoom or other platforms like skype or google hangouts and as a teacher led model where the teacher continues teaching and uh, the students at home log in now the problem with that is that it doesn't always work on a distance learning platform the first thing we have to do is understand that it requires us to deliver education in these distant times differently but then the that's a i think that's an opportunity to us for us to even rethink a, is this idea of putting teachers at the center of instruction always the best thing because it doesn't i mean you take the teacher out of the equation should the learning stop we have to i think the mindset has to change both for parents and for schools that instruction can does not have to be teacher led it's okay if it's i mean i mean there are multiple scenarios we can look at but there's also uh, you know you can also use online lms you can use online video content that's already out there and the teacher can play a role more of a mentor more of a guide somebody who checks in more often uh, with each individual child then just to sit in front of a camera and just repeat a lecture 